United Airlines have been flying into Ireland for the last 18 years. With the great service we offer out of Ireland, our customers can connect with our hubs in the US. We connect with New York, Chicago and Washington from Ireland. When our customers reach our hubs, they then have a choice of a huge network which will bring them to 300 destinations across the Americas. I'm really pleased to be able to say that our second daily service to Newark will operate year-round, offering even a bigger choice for our customers to reach the Big Apple. OK, so I feel Ireland needs to actually present itself as uh, having an ecosystem that will welcome these types of companies. And from a cybersecurity point of view, which is what our company does, uh, we help companies uh, from the FDI list come to Ireland and actually um, integrate from the point of view of their secure technology, regulations, all, all of that uh, related area. And it's very important that Ireland is able to present itself as a secure country, that is able to detect uh, any risks in those areas and able to deal with them and also to make uh, regulations easier for uh, companies from all over the world to come to Ireland and to understand. Ireland should continue to make it easier for businesses to do uh, their activities in and from Ireland. Um, recent good examples would include the overhaul of the Companies Act and the availability of uh, R&D tax credits. We should continue to invest in our third level institutions, particularly in relation to science, engineering and IT to ensure we have and continue to offer the best and most attractive workforce. Countries, for example, like the United States, where the federal government, it's easy for them to protect the homeland security all in one uh, holistic way. And that's what Ireland needs to do as well. They need to see that there's an advantage, a competitive advantage as a nation, to be portrayed as a secure nation for companies to actually operate and do business in. Of course, new markets equal new opportunities. Asia, South America, Africa. However, these are vast geographies and massive economies, so we must be targeted with our approach and play to our strengths. Uh, in order to focus companies in, we should uh, leverage off our wealth of experience and expertise in food agriculture, information technology, and financial services. If what we protect are the top companies around the world, we help them from the point of view of understanding technical, cyber security related risks, as well as the regulations. And it is a minefield for organisations to do it. And we see that this is something that is a, a, almost a barrier for entry into Europe for a lot of, say, for example, American companies, because they have to understand that the, the different culture of privacy laws, cyber security, data, information security related type laws right across Europe are vastly different as you go across. It's not the same right across Europe. So this is something that we can help these organisations with. And this is this is our sweet spot, if you like, is helping companies like this actually uh, operate securely within Europe. Cathico International is an indigenous corporate administration services provider. It is important for us to be involved in the business and finance FDI, uh, FDI 100 for the reason this is a leading event of its kind in the country and attracts a broad spectrum of existing and potential inward investing companies.